Fix Bluetooth devices keep disconnecting from Mac with these 8 steps. Restart your Mac. Rebooting your Mac will eliminate any minor bug that the software might have encountered. Turn the Bluetooth off and then turn it back on. Click on the Apple logo and select System Preferences. Click on Bluetooth. Then, click on Turn Bluetooth Off. All your devices will get disconnected, including the Magic Mouse and the Keyboard. Wait for a few seconds and connect your Magic Mouse and Keyboard to the Mac using a lightning cable. Then, click on Turn Bluetooth On if it didn't turn on automatically. Reconnect Bluetooth Devices. Click on the Apple logo and then select System Preferences. Click on Bluetooth. Now, hover over a connected device and click on the X button. When a window appears, click on Remove. Do this with all connected devices. Wait for a few seconds and reconnect the necessary ones. When the device is ready to be connected, click on Connect. Delete Bluetooth plist files. When Finder is launched, from the menu bar, click on Go and select Go to Folder. In the path bar, enter slash library slash preferences. Look for the file named com.apple.bluetooth.plist and delete it by right-clicking on it and selecting Move to Bin or Dragging to Bin. Now, click on Go and select Go to Folder again. In the path bar, enter tilde slash library slash preferences slash by host. Look for the file names com.apple.bluetooth.randomletters and numbers.plist and delete it by right-clicking on it and selecting Move to Bin or Dragging to Bin. Empty the trash. Then, restart your Mac. Remove all USB devices. Sometimes disconnecting all USB devices from your Mac can fix issues with Bluetooth. If your keyboard and or mouse are connected to Mac with a USB cable, disconnect them as well. Then, restart your Mac. When Mac boots, wait for a few minutes and connect the USB devices again. Reset Non-Volatile Random Access Memory and System Management Controller To reset non-volatile random access memory, shut down the Mac. Turn it on, and after you hear a loading chime, simultaneously hold the option, Command, P, and R buttons. Keep holding this combination for at least 20 seconds your computer should appear to be restarting. If you hear the startup chime again, release the buttons. On newer Macs, you won't hear the startup sound, Release the keys when you see the Apple logo for the second time. To reset system management controller for MacBooks with a non-removable battery, shut down the device and connect the power adapter to the Mac. Hold down the Shift, Control, and Option keys while clicking the power button. Finally, release all keys simultaneously. The light on the MagSafe adapter might change color to signify that SMC has been reset. To reset system management controller for laptops with a removable battery, Shut down the MacBook and remove the battery. Disconnect the power adapter, hold the power key for 10 seconds, release the button and reattach your power adapter and battery. Update your Mac's operating system. Click on the Apple logo and go to System Preferences. Then click on Software Update. Wait for Mac to search for updates. If found any, update Mac OS. Reset the Bluetooth module. Click on the Apple logo and select System Preferences. Click on Dock and Menu Bar, from the sidebar, select Bluetooth. Check the box next to Show in Menu Bar. A Bluetooth menu will appear on the Menu Bar. Now hold down the Shift plus Option keys on your keyboard, and from the Menu Bar, click on the Bluetooth icon to view more settings. Click on Reset the Bluetooth module, then click on OK and restart your Mac. Hopefully, this video provided the information you were looking for. If you're using a Mac computer, we would like to suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. It will check your computer for malicious software infections and advertising supported software. Combo Cleaner also offers a disk cleaner that will help you clean out the junk accumulated on your Mac. A big files finder that will help you find files that take up the most space on your Mac. A duplicate file finder, which will easily find all duplicate files on local and external hard drives a privacy scanner that will help you remove cookies, cache, browse history and more. And an app uninstaller that will find all hidden app components and uninstall them for you. You won't need to worry about viruses and clutter on your Mac anymore. Thank you for watching. 
If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel.